Hey everybody, welcome to Metal. Today, we're going to try to catch us another 22 short. This time, I found something a little different. Y'all know me, I was at the Dollar Tree hunting around. They had this soap in a twin pack. So I think this would be a good medium to catch us a nice little 22 short. I'm using some of that Winchester Super X. Yep, big boar, baby. And we're shooting it out of our Keystone Cricket. I think it's a 10 and 5 8 inch barrel. Little single shot 22. This thing's a lot of fun. But, like I say, seen these. Uh, actually, I think it was my mom who mentioned, uh, hey, what do you think about shooting soap? And I'm like, hey, it works for me. I think it'll be a good bullet catcher, and I haven't done it yet. So I got me a little setup over here to hold them, where hopefully it holds them good and tight and we'll catch this bullet. Uh, let me show you that rig. Now here's what we got. Got me a little metal tray here, and we have eight bars down in here. I think the weight of this uh, six by six chunk will hold that in place pretty well. So I can just stand right here and bang. And see how this action works. All right, so let's get our camera set up and get this big bore around into this big bore pistol and make this shot. Y'all throw your guesses down below. Uh, I am going to guess at 22 short, that soap's pretty dense and it isn't that holder holding it still. I'm going for four bars. It'll get stuck in the fourth one. That's my guess. Y'all throw yours down, and uh, I think this will be quite interesting. All right, I repositioned y'all a little bit, so uh, you should be able to see that really well. And we do have the other camera for more of a close-up and a slow-mo. So, grab our little cricket and our 22 short. And we get down here and make this shot up close and personal. Alright, fire and all. Alright, got it a little low right there. Let's check them. Make sure the bullet didn't go down and out. Which there's not a hole in the table, so I don't think it did. Uh, let me bring y'all right up here. Oh, guys, trying to get a good, uh, there we go. Maybe that'll work out a little bit better. The sun's starting to come in. Like I say, I'm out here early in the morning, so it happens. All right, there's our first two bars. Like I say, we got it right down here. Boy, it came right out. Hopefully y'all can see right through that like I just did. Yeah, hard to hold it. But it did. It went through two. Now, here's our next two. There's our entrance hole. Oh, wow. It went through them two. Well, there went my guess. Let's grab our next two. There's our entrance. Oh, you got to be kidding me. That looks like an exit right there. That definitely looked like an exit. So that's six of them. They look like an entrance to me. You gotta be kidding me. It went through eight of them soap bars. I'm actually opening these up. Just interested to see what kind of damage that 22 short done. And there's that first bar. Looks like you can see plumb through it. Boy, it really mushroomed out. It made a big cavity in that thing. There's a second bar. 
Yeah, that little bullet was uh, no joke. Well, let's check this last one. Here's the last one in our bunch as it went out. Like I say, I surely didn't think that it would go through eight of them, that's for sure. I figured four would catch it. Number seven. Well, small hole compared to the first. That is odd the way that that happened. You'd think that the hole would get bigger as it went along. And uh, I know I took his out correctly because there's number seven. Remember, it came out towards the bottom. I mean, number eight. I'm sorry. There it is. There's the entrance. There's the exit. Now that is just a trip. So there you have it. Uh, it's very apparent that I need to start buying more of a product to do tests with, even with a 22 short. See, like everything I do with that little 22 short round surprises me and exceeds my expectations. Like I say, I thought this would be four. Turned out it went plumb through number eight. And uh, yeah, I mean, that was just uh, very unexpected. Hey, this soap's still good enough to shoot again. So we'll just stick that back in the box and save it for another day. Well, guys, appreciate you watching. Hope you enjoyed that. Interested to see what the comments are going to be. Uh, if you would, please hit that like, share, and subscribe. And uh, big time, share with your friends. Get these videos out there. I sure do appreciate it. And again, looking forward to y'all's comments. And until the next one, I hope that everyone has a fantastic day.